I'm so excited to see the Dalai Lama because he's such a big figure. Um, and I'm, I feel really lucky that he chose San Diego State University to come to speak to. I really want to get that first-hand experience hearing about his views on building peace in the world. And he's been committed to it for such a long time. It's really inspiring. I've never had the opportunity actually to see him live, but I think his words are very inspirational and can touch any person across the world and the country. I'm choosing to go see the Dalai Lama just because he's one of the most um, influential if you want to call it philosophical, religious figures of our time. Um, I'm really interested in seeing the Dalai Lama and I'm really excited about Thursday because I just can't wait to hear what he has to say. Um, it is called Compassion Without Borders, so whatever I can learn from the Dalai Lama and take with me in my life is a really exciting opportunity. And if I could ask him one question, I would want to know what his views are on how we can help people feel more connected in a time where people are so polarized, especially in this country and throughout the world. It would probably just be his interpretation on the meaning of life. If you were able to stay in San Diego and work with our students and our alumni and alumni, what would you work on first and how would you best help them? If he has decided if he's going to be reincarnated or not, um, since I have read that he's not sure, and if he decides to, if it's actually going to be um, a, for a man or a woman. If I had one question to ask him, I would say, what type of specific um, suggestions do you have for San Diego State to become a more united people? Because we have different student organizations, different types of people that are active on campus, but what can we do to become more united and to work together to bring peace to the campus?